All right, so we're gonna go ahead and send it over to Michael Marks and Tina. They have some fruit cooking in our oh. new kitchen sets. Yes, ah. kitchen mark. What, yeah. Why do I need this? Why am I, I working? Uh, because you're gonna skewer. You're skewering. Okay. Uh, so Ruben, I have a question for you. Yes, sir. What percentage of nectarines, okay. yellow flesh nectarines, what percentage of yellow flesh nectarines were developed after 1945? After 1945? What percentage? I would say 22%. Uh, so close, 100%. 100? Up until 1945, all nectarines were white in flesh. Mm. Uh, and they were very delicate. So Fred Anderson uh, and a oh, couple Fred, of... Fred, yeah. You know Fred. Yeah. yeah. Uh, he go way back. He created the first yellow flesh neck ring, which was a breakthrough but because... But how did he do that? A lot of work. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of work. Uh, and it was a breakthrough because a yellow flesh nectarine is a firmer flesh fruit. Mm -hmm. uh, white flesh is very tender, mm -hmm. very, very, very tender, mm -hmm. right? Uh, the, the old varieties were. Yeah. In fact, uh, for the kings and queens of England, they used to harvest the white flesh nectarines on pillows. Really? And take them into the castles. Oh. Because that's how delicate they were. Uh, anyway, uh, we're going to do sword in the stone. I do sword fish. It's a white flesh fish. And it's a firm fish, right? Okay. So I do sword fish, get it sword in the stone. Uh, we're gonna do some uh, white flesh nectarine. Uh, and as you did, we're gonna cut off one cheek. It's actually called a cheek. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna cut off the other cheek. And uh, let's turn those over and that, there we go. So you got those. Now we're gonna, we're gonna put some, uh, some zucchini squash on there. Oh. I'm gonna teach you a, a very particular cut. Okay. It's called an oblique cut. Oblique. Oblique cut is like this and like this. See that? Yeah. Or it's also Opposite. called a roll cut. You roll it there, roll it there. <laughs> called a roll cut. You oh. do it either way. Okay. So you not now you have these nice chunks, right? Yeah. Uh, so there you go. There's a skewer. Here is the swordfish. <laughs> Watch out, Tina. I, 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 yeah, the skewer. Wait a minute. Yes, you use... want me to touch the fish. Yes, that's why you have the and glove it goes on. on the left hand. Oh, sorry about that. That's okay. Uh, while you're doing that, here's all the other ingredients for our rubbed, uh, our, our rub that's going to go on it. There it all is. Okay. Uh, two tablespoons of uh, olive oil, two tablespoons of apple juice, two Damn. tablespoons of uh, rubbed sage. This way? Mm. Or this way? Either way you want. Well, it probably look prettier this yes, way, Yes, it right? would look prettier that way. Uh, and, and then uh, a little bit of pepper, this way some this lemon way? juice, whatever you want. Well, it's right. your doing. Oh, look, it, I made a boo-boo. I made a boo-boo. <laughs> <It's your. laughs> well, go that way then. <laughs> there you go. Uh, do another one. Okay. Yeah, just keep going. And uh, and so what we've done, oh. we, we took all of those ingredients and we made this nice little slurry. I want you to smell this slurry, Tina Makua. I'm gonna put it up. You smell the slurry. Mmm. Mm. Isn't that good? Mm -hmm. Right? Why are you saying mmm <laughs> over there when you can't smell it? You can smell it all the way. I'm going after you. Okay. <laughs> I love your uh, expressions. <laughs> okay, there you go. Look at that. Okay. Isn't that pretty? Yeah. Now we're gonna take uh, a brush. Yeah. Uh, you can get your kids or your grandkids uh, in the kitchen, out by the grill, and just gonna rub this all over, just like so. So easy. Oh so my what goodness. So what are the parts in that rub? Oh, uh, look right over there. Two tablespoons of olive oil, two Correct. tablespoons of uh, lemon juice, two tablespoons of apple juice. Uh, two tablespoons of the rubbed sage, uh, and then a little bit of pepper and a little bit of... You uh, always make it simplistic, two, 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 two. Uh, it, my mind has to do that. Have I met Ruben before? Uh, Ruben, this is Michael Marks. <laughs> this nice is Ruben Galvez. <laughs> Tina, Ma Tina Makua, how did the peach feel after it had been eaten? How? Pitiful. All right, that was a good joke. That was a good a semi-good produce joke for a semi-retired. I like the other one la last uh, you hour. You like the other yeah. one? Yeah, okay. so because he's trying to get new jokes. If you have any, I know they're like dad jokes, but he's trying to say them for the state fair, which is mid-July. July 12th through the 29th. You and I will both be out there. That's right. Building B. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> At where? The Save Mark Kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. All right, thanks, Michael. Thank okay. you. Good seeing you. You bet. All right, good stuff. All right, I'm loving the shirt. All right.